Have you ever had a problem with a cabinet door falling off because of the way that it was constructed with plastic little pieces that the screws go into? Well, that's the problem I had with this door and I'm gonna show you how I fixed it. Here's the fix it, mom. Gonna fix something again. Um, my door keeps falling off because these little plastic things, I hate plastic. Have I ever said that before? I hate plastic. Those things are splitting and they're breaking and the screws are not holding. So this thing falls completely out and it's useless. So what I am going to do is I've got this peg that fits the hole. I'm gonna cut this off into little sections and I'm gonna glue pegs in the hole so it's a solid piece of wood. But I need to get these screws out because I'm just gonna screw the wood the screws right into the wood after it's thoroughly solid piece of wood. And so that's how I'm going to fix it pretty easy, right? I just need to cut that up. Okay, I forgot to press record. But what I did is I held my little thing and I ran it under the bandsaw. The bandsaw just goes up and down. It's stationary blade. So I have my pieces. I lost one, but that's okay. I, I need four because one went flying. I forgot to press the cord, so I couldn't show you that. Sorry. But yeah, I just use a pair of needle nose pliers to hold them because I don't want to get my fingers closed. And if they're not perfectly straight, that's fine because I can sand them off once I have them glued in place. Okay, to remove the screws, I'm here about eight and adjustable wrench. And I want to get a good grip of the plastic and we have to hold the screw steady so it doesn't turn and then I just rotate just rotate the oh come on we gotta hold this steady okay I'm going to use glue and fill up this hole really good This is a tacky glue. It's good for all, all surfaces, especially good for wood. And make sure I get the bottom and all the sides. Okay, then we take our little piece. sand it a little bit to make sure it's even and then we'll be able to put our doors back on so I sanded it to make sure it's level it's had plenty of time to dry so now when I put the screw in it can go right into the wood so I won't have to worry about it coming off Now my door works properly and it doesn't fall off. Ta-da! Now that was an easy fix, so I hope you could find that useful. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel to see what other repairs we can do around the house.